everyone, this is Honeywell. Are you ready for day two of spring? Mm -hmm. uh, it should be another busy day of work and more work. Mm -hmm. uh, but that's fine. It'll be fun. Uh, rain tomorrow. Which I think it's always scripted to rain on the third day of spring. Oh. Okay, so we have uh, jars. We want to plant this field and we want to uh, take care of the animals. We also want to plant those tulips. Fun times. Let's see. Uh, stone. Clay. And what do we have? 20? Um, do you remember that little experiment we did with uh, quality retaining soil? We're going to try it again. Um, I like the tulips, so we're just going to dot them around uh, the beehives and maybe some in the barnyard. And we're going to plant them on quality retaining soil and just see what happens. I really don't care um, if what quality honey we get. I mean, in the spring, it's like worth... If you use blue jazz, which is the best, I think it might be worth 200 uh, gold, uh, a jar of honey. Uh, I don't care about that at all. Um, so, yeah. So we'll see what happens with that. Um, what else are we doing today? The barnyard. Uh, we're going to... clean out our chests in order to come up with uh, 50 things to process. Um, one, let's sell these. We don't need those. You know, we don't even need that. Let's sell those. Uh, we're going to get, it's spring again, and we'll get iridium quality, all of that, so we don't need that. Yeah, so we don't even need the horseradish either. Let's sell that too. Okay. Um, do we need to ship grapes? Uh, those are blackberries. That means we need to ship 14 grapes and, or 15 grapes plus, plus Vincent likes these. So we're not going to use grapes in this thing. Let's run to this uh, box one more time. Sure, we can do those. I'm going to save these for a bit. Mm. We can do... This is a month worth of gifts. Plus, he likes that cranberry candy. I mean, honestly, how much am I going to be seeing Vincent? It's fine. And uh, grapes are a summer fruit anyway. So, so this is enough for the month. And next summer we'll have more grapes, so that's fine. Um, let's use everything but the iridium quality. And those we're putting in the kegs. So that's <laughs> yeah, like like ten things. Forty more to go. Um, pomegranates are Elliot's favorite. Two months worth. Two, four, six, eight is a month's worth. Am I really going to give? That's fine. Uh, the apples we don't need. The yams we don't need. Yams, we ship the 15. We put whatever one we needed in the cooking bin already. Okay, so that's fine. What else do we have? Uh, eggplant, corn, 
the tortillas are used for the lucky lunches. So I just want to keep some of those on hand. Um, bok choy. Evelyn likes beets, so I'd like to keep a couple beets for her, just because they're gold star items. This amaranth, I think, can go. What do we have here? Bok choy. Oh no, we need to ship six bok choy. Six bok choy. And beets we need to ship, too. Okay. Uh, okay, we need to ship six, so... Two, we need to ship those. What else do we have? Um, and then we can do if we need more, we can do blackberries and we can give those to what's his face, Harvey. Okay, so that's good enough. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm doing this also more so to uh, clean out my inventory than in an attempt to make money. Mm -hmm. um, So I'm not going to keep doing this. Like I could put, maybe I'll put some, um, maybe I'll do like the next time, the next round, I'll do like a whole round of, um, like blackberries, but then we're going to leave these, uh, preserve jars sit until, until we have something, uh, worth preserving. Cause this is honestly, this isn't worth my time. probably have some of uh, the garden food the ones that we did for kind of like the kitchen garden maybe we can preserve some of this stuff but most of it's being shipped uh, let's do apples do we need apples for anything no let's don't hoard <laughs> do not hoard I would like to keep everything, but that's ridiculous. It's just a get rid of it all. Okay, that's good. And then we still have these pomegranates for Elliot. No. Oh no, the fertilizer went away. When I planted those, it was um it was on quality retaining or you know, speed grow. Deluxe speed grow, and now it's not. Oh, that's pretty disappointing.
must be a rock. Okay. That is good. Now let's um let's put some tulips in here too. Just for fun. Probably putting a scarecrow over here if I'm doing this. Uh, do I have one? I need a piece of coal to make one, so. some of these by the uh, the beehives the uh, blue jazz is the better uh, honey for this uh, spring it sells for more um, but like I said I don't I don't care how much we get for the honey it's just it's more of a nice thing to have than uh, something we need It's already three o'clock. I think I'm just gonna um, say hi to these animals and let them out. Because, uh, because why? Because they only have a little bit left before they'll wanna come back inside. See if they stay in the yard and they do well not exactly stay in the yard but I think that what the rabbits out already around.
Okay, let's um let's plan up these other two fields and then we'll go around and uh spruce up the farm a little bit. Robin. Robin decided she did not like uh, the limits of her Koopa area. What do we have? Um, let's get these stupid bean starters out. Um, cauliflower? Sure. potatoes and some what some blue jazz with uh, the very blue seeds <laughs> um, kale yeah let's do a uh, garlic. That works. Mm -hmm. And this is just to cook with and to ship. Like, no biggie. Okay, let's put away all these seeds. Seeds away. Oh, look at that. That is much better. Good, good. This is nice too. Forage. Um, let's make a scarecrow. Where could we put it? Right here? Would that look cute? Or we should put it on this side, because it would probably cover more. Yeah. That's nice. I like it. I think our, I think our uh, barnyard is uh, pretty adorable right now. Uh, there's a couple things that I'm happy with uh, with the farm. I like... I like the position of the the of the barn buildings. Um and I like the crab pot dock. Oh, I put away the tulip seeds. Let's go get them. Why am, why don't I not have a horse? What did I do with Miss Daisy? No. I am so sorry, Miss Daisy. Oh, I left her right here. Um, let's Oh, 
right there. Um, one right here, just because the spot is there. This is probably, I would probably be better off um, doing these like neat and orderly instead of kind of like just scattered. Uh, but really I'm just seeing if it, if they even come up. Cause I don't want to, um, I don't want sprinklers throughout my fields anywhere. Cause that, it just makes it annoying to uh, ride through. Is it 12 o'clock? Uh, for as much as we have done, um, I'm kind of like, I'm kind of impressed with uh, getting all of these fields planted, all of the uh, stuff done, starting to work on uh, some pretty stuff. I, uh, I think we're doing good. I guess we should start heading home because I lost the horse again. Poor Miss Daisy. Um, definitely over here. And I'll, I want to work on the paths too. I'm pretty sure I want um, everywhere. Once I see uh, how I, how I move about the farm, um, I'll put in like a path system. I know I'm going to probably want something like around this pond area. Um, But where the other paths go, I don't know. We will see. And and it will not be a Honeywell episode if I was not uh, on the verge of passing out. Yes, go to sleep for the night. What did we get for that? Oh, we had some cranberry jelly. Okay, that's nice. Not bad. And that is going to end another episode of Honeydale Farm. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.